In this project, we will once again be using the books database. And this is the form that we will create. It will have grid view, bunch of buttons, and that's really all there is to it. When the form loads, it will display the author, title, and the publisher name for all the titles. However, we can specify what author we want by clicking any of these buttons. So when I click the button H, I only get titles for the authors whose names start with H. As you can see, when I click Z, I'll get all the Z, A, I'll get all the authors whose names start with A, X, X has only one record, one author. So when I click show all records, I once again populate the grid view with all the records from the database without any specific sorting. It simply displays all the authors and their titles. So this is a fun project because it will show you how to create the buttons programmatically. We are not going to be dropping 26 buttons on our forms from our toolbox. Instead, we will create an array of buttons and we will display them programmatically when the form loads. And also, instead of having 26 events for each of these buttons, we will have only one event that will serve all these buttons. But of course, it will also help you practice more the database aspect, like the connection, the commands, the adapter and all the other stuff related to the C-sharp and databases. So let's have some fun.